How you doing? I'm Sean McVeigh with Sean's Outdoor Adventures, and in this video, I'm going to show you how I made a bow, endless loop bowstring jig for about 60 bucks. First thing I did is I got a 10 foot piece of uni strut, which is this right here, and then I bolted it to the table. Then I cut two one foot sections of the uni strut off of the end. To make these pieces here this one and this one then i bought four six inch long bolts half inch bolts and a quarter inch bolt to go down into them and what i did is i took it to the local tool and die shop and had the guy tap them and thread them to screw that down in there So those have created my posts for the string jig. Now on one end of the string jig, I made, I put these, I, you know, just drilled a hole and put these screws through. And what this does is when you're starting your, how to make your string, well, I'll do a different video on how I'm making strings, but you wrap the string around here and then around the post, and then you um, loop it around both ends and you uh, basically tighten down on the string so it can't slide out. That's basically what that's for. So when you're making a string, you start off with the, um, you know, I just have a bolt going down through. And in the uni strut, let me pop one of these out. You have this little nut end there. And the bolt that's in the middle of this string arm, whatever you want to call it, goes down in and uh, screws into that. And these can be moved anywhere along the uni strut so you can easily change your string length. So there you have, when you're starting off, you wrap your string around that way and then you rotate this and, you know, uh, tighten it down for when you're doing your serving on your end. Then what I do is I actually take these off once I get the string part, the very ends of the string. Let me just do this real quick and show you. I take both of these off. And then I bolt on these two pieces that I made. And what I did is I cut another small section, about four inches long, of the uni strut for, to make two of these. And then I put the string on the hooks here. And you can tighten this up, and that'll stretch the string. So that's essentially your string stretcher right there. And then you, do, you finish your serving. Uh, all this, the, the uni strut itself was about 20 bucks. Uh, the, all the bolts collectively were probably about twelve to fifteen dollars. I paid the um, the guy at the tool and die shop ten bucks to tap that for me, and I had a piece of I had angle iron at the house, so I just cut some pieces of that off to make this part of it. And that's basically it. That's how I made a bowstring making jig. And like I said, once I added it all up and you know paid the guy at the tool and die shop, it probably came out to about 50, 60 bucks. I actually spent a little bit more because when I first got the bolts, I tried to drill them and tap them myself and I kept breaking the, the taps and stuff like that. So I spent a little extra money, but um, that's how I made it. And uh, if you're interested in getting into it, this is an economical approach to doing that. Thanks for tuning in. Take care and God bless.